Hey guys, it's Ashley here with Fill in the Freezer. In Arkansas, we're allowed to keep a number of hand-captured native wildlife as pets. Squirrels, bobcats, possums, raccoons, and certain species of turtles are all on that list. So when a tiny orphan possum came into my life, I didn't hesitate to save him. This is his story. On July 14th, I found this little orphan possum all alone, so I immediately brought him home and began warming him up. He was so young and tiny that he couldn't even regulate his own body temperature. He weighed only two ounces and he was cold, weak, and shaky. At first I fed him puppy formula every two hours through a syringe, even through the night. I had to rub his belly with a warm, damp towel so he could go to the bathroom. Sometimes he wouldn't eat and I was afraid that he wasn't going to make it. Nine days after I had found him, the little guy weighed 3.1 ounces. I started mixing his formula with oatmeal baby cereal. He didn't want it at first, but then he started licking it off our fingers, and I was able to switch the time between his feedings every four hours. I was so proud of him. I awarded him with the name Remy. After that, Remy became more and more active every day. I started letting my younger siblings help me feed him. He started eating yogurt, vegetables, fruit, and cat food, but his absolute favorite food became crickets and mealworms. Yeah. The four ounce mark took a while to get to, but once he passed it, Remy gained weight very rapidly. He loved riding around on my shoulders and sitting on top of my head. now. He weighs over eight pounds now. And he's super healthy. Isn't that right, Remy? Oh, he's good.
I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like it if you liked it and subscribe to our channel for more of our videos. See you next time. Come here. Come on.